Savick. Hello. Today we are very delighted to have Mr. Mahari with us. Hello, Mr. Mahari. Hello, Kelly. Hi. So I see a lot of interesting innovation that's around in this showcase. Yes. Could you share with us some of the uh, innovation that you are proud of? Yes. Indeed. Uh, greetings, everyone. Uh, I'm happy here to share some of our uh, products. And then, as you know, in China, one of the fastest growing market is uh, with the electric uh, vehicles. Yeah. And then having an efficient and reliable charging station infrastructure is going to be very critical to the success of uh, transitioning to the electric vehicles. Yeah. So we are proudly showing our demo unit here. Uh, our EV charging station demo unit that is made all in plastics yeah and then we would like to uh, share with you the benefits of the plastics but then be aware that most of these type of uh, applications have been conventionally using metals so there are benefits of replacing metals with plastics such as in safety or in aesthetics where we are able to uh, enhance some kind of complex designs and then also with our cost that we can uh, be able to control and lower the cost and then also with the environment where we can um, do the molding color we can do the uh, carbon footprint reduction etc so very it cool. is yeah. it is very uh, very Perfect. unique yeah it, indeed so um, let me also share with you the, the teardown of this, right? So if you look at the outside, uh, the external part really is uh, molded in uh, color, uh, our polycarbonate, uh, Sabic Lexan uh, materials, right? Uh, this features the mechanical properties and then also the aesthetics and then also the uh, safety with uh, FR uh, resistance, right? So this, uh, the external part, and then there is an internal part where it is also made with uh, very structural, uh, high stiffness, uh, glass filled polypropylene materials, our Stamex uh, resins. So the Stamex has the properties, also the features of safeties because of the mechanicals, as well as the, uh, the ability to integrate uh, complex geometries into one part so that you can combine uh, the different features together so to, to improve the design. So all in all, I would say that there are significant benefits of plastic starting with the safety, where you have the mechanicals, you have the uh, FR, the frame retardancy, right? Uh, and then second is the aesthetics, where you can have the different design com complex uh, geometries that you can combine together to produce the parts. And then the processing where with the plastics you can do a lot of, um, let's say, quicker, better cycle time for the conversion. You reduce time and then improve the cost. Yeah, And then uh, also be able to do, uh, let's say, 2K molding. Yeah, And then uh, last but not least, the environment where you have, for example, the molded in uh, color where you can um, replace paint. You don't need a paint, you don't need painting, so you save the environment. As well as the carbon footprint reduction because of our True Circle uh, products that we have. Yeah. Thank you. Indeed, this is a very interesting product. And I think the audience is like me. They're curious about uh, how the, the development of Savit in 2022 and also the future plan. Yes. Yeah. Well, the, the future plan for Sabic is, uh, is very simple. If you look back the what we have done in the past up to, up to present, we really focus on the three pillars in terms of our development, right? We focus on people, people? we focus on planet, and then we also prop focus on the prosperity, the, the fact that we can differentiate and grow, right? So uh, with that, we, have, we, are, we are able to launch uh, a few product lines in the past, like our True Soko uh, from, let's say, 2019 or so. And then actually, some of those True Circle products are featured in uh, some of the products here behind you. Oh. If you look at, for example, the mouse, there is that mouse. Uh, that is our collaboration with Microsoft. 
where we use the ocean plastics uh, to one, produce the, the, the mouse uh, with that. And then uh, the intent there is to be able to uh, cut back, cut down the pollution to the uh, ocean, right? So you collect the plastics and then you use part of that, you convert that to the mouse. And the other product that we have is, is uh, you say, the toys here. Oh, this this is, yeah. Oh, and this then is very cute. Yeah. yeah. That is made with uh, Mattel. Yeah. This is uh, the toy blocks uh, that is uh, polypropylene with the renewable feedstock. And then part of the, the intent there is uh, be able to reduce the carbon footprint because of, the, uh, of that renewable feedstock that is uh, really not competing with uh, food uh, uh, type of uh, feedstock, yeah. Thank you. There are a lot of interesting applications of Savic yes. that has been trying to do. Yes. And, um, is there uh, any more like hot topics that you would like to cover in this show in China? Park? Yes, uh, we are, our theme is, uh, of course, is to uh, grow and then to differentiate and then to be able to collaborate with our customers uh, throughout the value chain. So, so we work with all of you that is not just uh, in China but also globally to be able to bring uh, the, the different opportunities or the different ambition that you may have whether that is coming from the environment, the planet, the sustainability or, or growing together mutually. Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you Kelly. so much for yeah. sharing with all of us Mahari. Okay. Also, um, visitors who are interested in the toys and the charging station, you are very welcome to come to the booth 78125 to visit Savic. And our online friends, you can view China Plus live platform. Thank you. Thank you, Kelly. Thank you. Thank you.